All right, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Robert. I'm back for another reaction video. And this time around, I'm checking out this battle that's not an epic rap battle, but you had two people from epic rap, epic rap battles. You got um, Epic Lloyd, which is one of their creators, and you got this other guy who was on epic rap battles, a uh, famous YouTuber named T uh, Timothy Delegato. Okay, I'm checking this other video they did together. It's not an official epic rap battle, but it definitely could have been. Um, from what I'm hearing about it, and I heard like a piece of it, I'm like, ooh, that beat is fire, I gotta hold off and react to it, because it was that good, just with the little sliver that I heard, I'm really wait, wait, wanting to check this out, um, it's, and we got Alexander Hamilton versus Satoshi, this guy is the creator of Bitcoin, Alexander Hamilton is the guy who, um, minted the National Bank, and has founded the National Bank, so yeah. We're about to get into this and kicking off this video in three, two, one, and go. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight we gather online as citizens of the world to judge two experts in a critical debate. In this corner, yes. the creator of centralized banking. Nice banking. Make some noise for yeah. Alexander Hamilton. Yeah. Yeah. And in this corner, yeah, the creator what? of the Bitcoin. The believer in the blockchain. Give it up for Satoshi Nakamoto. <laughs> Mr. Hamilton, you may begin. Let's go. Before we begin, everyone do me a favor Thanks. and read a little thing I wrote called the Federalist Papers. Yeah. I explain how a nation's unlikely to survive without a strong central government to keep it alive. When I launched the central bank, Jefferson called me ill. Now you have my <laughs> face to thank on every $10 bill. When America was cash-strapped, I pushed past that. Now some sicko makes crypto and our nation backtracks. Decentralized currency? Yes, I invented it. I'm sure many governments wish they had prevented it. The national cash is how they keep control. But freedom to the people was my ultimate. Goal. Yeah. Am I a pseudonym? A group of men? It doesn't even matter. Nope. I invented Bitcoin because fiat is a disaster. A man from Japan or a damn hologram. I'm the reason open season on crypto began. Does anybody know what this crypto thing means? Nope. To me, sounds like the new get broke quick scheme. Yeah, a bunch <laughs> of fools from across the land investing in something they don't even understand. Buying Litecoin yeah, cash, Bitcoin cash. It's all gonna crash and be gone in a flash. All this unsupported money is an irrational prank. And I'll be laughing all the way to my national bank. <laughs> yeah, dude, super funny. As if banks these days still help people make money. The rich get richer and we follow like we're all sheep. The banks serve Wall Street. Crypto serves all streets. The interest in crypto is on rapid ascent. What's your current interest? Like half a percent? I'm sorry, the bank's gone past its peak. But I want info encrypted, not hacked and leaked. If this crypto system will be our salvation, it needs to be centralized, needs regulation. If our central database gets how you say hack, insurance will just make a case to get your money. Money back, cause in fact it's trapped, and the money leaves a trail. Central currency is strong, cryptocurrency is frail. Untraceable money, wow, so clever. One typo in your address, now it's gone forever. Crypto is frail, that's the essence of your lesson. Your money leaves a trail, yeah, a trail to a recession. A bunch of rich white guys made this system. Why would they ever change it when it made them rich men? Movie mode yeah. fought hard against the VCR. Horse and buggy manufacturers all hated the car. So why would I take my advice from the banks? I don't need a bailout to survive. Thanks. The system Ooh. is so broken. Ooh. We need that crypto token. The system isn't broken. Can we trust crypto token? It's gotta be centralized. Decentralized. Centralized. Decentralized. We need control. Free enterprise. Please testify. Fiat's the way a government controls the populace. Government protects its people. All of this is obvious. They keep the peace, and so they keep control. You want us ruled by crypto miners no one even knows? Oh, it's that strong central government bit again. They protect people, but only their citizens. Crypto has no borders. It's a true global currency and censorship resistance for those who need it urgently. Banks earn trust by assuming liability. You know what key we know the customer explicitly. Will the real Satoshi please stand up? Nope, you'll still be hiding when crypto busts. You don't need to trust the people, you just need to trust the code. Every record's in the network, you just one node. And when you find a flaw, there's a software update. Now try updating cash. Go ahead, I'll wait. Wait, 
Cash works, you immediately pay. Crypto's a far worse medium of exchange. Can't Bitcoin the dentist, can't Bitcoin my breakfast, can't even use Bitcoin at Bitcoin conventions. No currency starts with universal adoption. It takes time and places to make it an option. Plus billions of people don't have bank accounts. No savings, no interest, no checks to bounce. You're saving the world, but what's the price you're paying? The only change you're creating is climate change. Power grids spiking all across the land. Overheated, no one needs it, hope it all gets banned. From the king of paper currency, the hypocrisy. For bills and forms and triplicates, you're killing all the trees. Don't like my power usage? Stop targeting my rights. I own my purchase power, and the market sets the price. It's gonna get real dark if this is crypto's night. They use your currency for crimes, that's your kryptonite. Most crimes are done with Benjamins, not the blockchain. There's a reason most dollars carry traces of cocaine. Where's your proof of work? That's pure speculation. Those dark net black markets need more regulation. The world's full of currencies, and this one makes it worse. 180 now, Bitcoin's 180 first. It's not the currency itself, oh. it's the method, man. You can't build things that last without a central plan. Crypto is a balance to the centralized model, cause things fall apart, the sensor cannot hide. If you end up having problems, I feel bad for you, son. I've got 99 problems, but a bit ain't one. Done. <laughs> Hold on, we are not having a duel. <laughs> Uh, that is the end of the debate. Nice. Now it's time for the people to choose who won. Let it be nice. known in the comments below. <laughs> My name is The Gift of Gab, and I am your host. Peace and love, y'all. I love that. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Epic Lloyd from Epic Rap uh, History. What's up? I'm Timothy Dale. I get off from YouTube stuff, Wild and Out stuff. Yeah, all right. What do you guys think about this crypto uh, thing, huh? Do you trust it? Do not. Leave us your opinion in the comments below. Let us know who you think won, nice. and if you want to win some Bitcoin, leave a comment because we're going to be choosing a random person nice. to win. I'm gonna leave a comment. Check the rules and regulations in the description below. And uh, thanks for watching. Uh. Look, I don't care what y'all say. That's an epic rap battle that y'all didn't make. Like that. Wow. Wow. Like I, that, I liked it and it's gonna get people actually talking and thinking about this what can we trust trust what we've trust what we know but has had flaws and been like yeah and they brought up legit points like we gotta bail y'all out the money isn't backed up anymore anyway and yeah this is a legit point so you have people coming up with this and it's like um wow just wow yeah so there's a lot I want to really learn about this particular subject, um, because money is everything. Money is, look, okay, so I am woefully um, ignorant to the full scope of what Bitcoin is, but I think a good point of what this video pointed on was most people are, and most people don't understand it, but y'all support this thing anyway that a lot of people don't fully understand, and y'all still doing that. But then you can kind of counter that through everybody understand the full intricacies of money. Do we understand the, the, the full aspects of what it takes to get your money and what money actually costs itself? Who guards money? Who Where your money's going when you get rid of it? Like, do people fully understand that? And there are legit digs and backs and forth that you can have with this. And I really wish they put this on the main channel Epic Rap Battle. Because that's where this really needs to be. Get people talking. And I think whoever put, whoever sponsored this, um, Rom, Rhyme Combiner, I think that's what they call himself. Uh, yeah. I'm, I really enjoyed this, and I really am glad it came across my path because it's not on Epic Rap Battles, and I wouldn't have re re normally gone out my way to check this out. But this was a great video for people to check out and really think about. And this is what I think Epic Rap Battles does at its core the best, getting these obscure people from history and obscure concepts, getting people thinking about it. And there's really a lot to say here. There's really a lot to say here and really a lot to people to think about. But, yeah... Um, guys, tell me what you think down in the comment section below. I thought it was a very interesting battle. I thought it was a very interesting concert that was talked about. What do you guys think about Bitcoin? What do you guys think about just um, systems of government handling money that we have today? What the problems are? What we can do better? And what we um, should just be striving to as a society move forward? I really love to hear what people got to say. And I know I have a lot of intelligent subscribers. So I'm really interested to hear what you guys um, think about this. Um, guys, comment below, please let me know. I'd love to see what you guys want to think about, what you guys think about, um, just in your daily lives, just how you think we ought to be going. All right, so, 
Again, that's been me. My name is Robert Smalls. Please leave a comment below for the videos you want me to check out. Uh, thank you again for checking me out, guys. Love you all so much. Thank you again everything for everything. Peace. Ciao for now. Thank you, guys.